good morning guys um welcome to our channel my name is pearl and this is grace's journey in god's faithfulness happy thanksgiving to you guys today is thanksgiving here in canada and it's been a long rough few weeks we have much to be thankful for today we're just going to do a quick video on how we spend our thanksgiving um i wanted to do some um decoration and go all out for my family but i was not able to it's been a long few years since we celebrated thanksgiving i think from the time gracie was born we have not celebrated thanksgiving uh not much holidays because being able being having to take care of gracie and so many things are happening it's been really hard sometimes and we've put a lot of things on hold here just last week we were talking about it and caleb told me mom we should celebrate thanksgiving let's do it and i said okay we're gonna do it and i wanted to go and shop and buy decorations and do all of these things but because gracie was sick i was not able to go out and do that she, a few weeks ago she was hospitalized for a few days came home sick it took that's the first time it took so long for gracie to recover from her sickness um and i was not able to go out to shop and to buy decorations to decorate the place i love to decorate you guys this is one of the things i do as well but caleb was like mom we don't need decorations to celebrate thanksgiving so we are going to do it anyways but i'm going to try my best to make the place look nice and smell nice and cook a nice dinner for my family come along celebrate thanksgiving with us So right now I am trying to get my glasses because we have not used these things in such a long time. Getting all my bowls and my dishes ready for us to celebrate. It's it's nice to celebrate you guys. If you guys can put things aside and just to spend some time with family and celebrate and to share some of the things that we are thankful for. It, it does help because we had such a good time and thank god caleb said mom let's celebrate thanksgiving because had he not said that i would not have done it i would have postponed it to another time but i am grateful that he encouraged me to do it and we did watch the end of the video to see how we ended our night it was it was a really really wonderful time guys we did not plan this like i said previously but we are trying hard to get stuff together and try to remember where we put stuff and try to arrange the table and make it look as nice as possible and i am so grateful that caleb stayed with me and he helped me out and paul helped as well but when we're doing stuff one has to stay with grace and the others work but we did a wonderful job Guys, I had to pull my flowers out of the vase to just try to beautify the table. Um, I couldn't find where I put my table runners, but guys, this is just a sample of real life at our home. You know, this was not staged. This was not something we had planned long ahead about. It's just something, you know, as a family, my son is saying, let's do it, mom. You know, you want to do it and you want to give them that special moment. We just want to make memories together. They will get older and remember when, you know, mom didn't plan on celebrating Thanksgiving. We had not done it in a while, but mom came together and I helped mom to put everything together. We came through and we had a wonderful time. I'm very proud of Caleb, the way he came through for me on that day. There he is finishing um, his finish. I let him finish setting up the table and I went to the kitchen to start with the dinner. I'm proud of you, Kiki. Thank you. Caleb is back in the kitchen trying to help me with dinner. Oh, my, my, my little boy has really grown up and he's really struggling but nonetheless he did not give up and he is really trying to help me put this thing together god bless you caleb to our new subscribers thank you so much for subscribing to our channel and to existing subscribers thank you for always coming back to view our videos 
so guys caleb was really struggling to cut these chestnuts my poor boy but he tried his best because he was really determined for us to have a thanksgiving dinner and he could not and his father jumped in to help him his father took over and we did all of he cut all of the chestnuts for me and this was awesome thank you paul and caleb for being such awesome helpers i love chestnut but unfortunately those were not good when they were cooked they were not good at all i had to throw all of them out and i was very sad and i was here preparing the veggies and the stuff that i would need to do the stuffing for the turkey i forgot to show you guys the clip where i was cleaning the turkey but we got a huge turkey and it's just the three of us that will be eating that turkey Here I am just sauteing the veggies for the stuffing. Caleb took over stirring the pot for me, the veggies, and I went over to do the sweet potatoes. We had some sweet potatoes with some cinnamon and some brown sugar. I just covered the dish with foil and I put it in the oven to bake. Holly is getting the pasta ready for the mac and cheese. I added some more carrots and rosemary and thyme to the turkey, but I did not catch that on camera. Now the mac and cheese, I mixed up everything and pouring it in a dish to put it in the oven guys gracie is not waiting <laughs> gracie is ready to eat <laughs> So we prepared some green beans, some mashed potato, the turkey and some potatoes. We had the mac and cheese casserole. We had sweet potatoes, some corn and turkey gravy as well. You guys, Gracie ate so much food. She enjoyed it. I'm so grateful that she had a huge appetite. Gracie got three servings and she just enjoyed it and i was really happy i love when i cook for people to eat if i cook and people don't eat then i am really not happy but they ate a lot and i was very happy thank god you guys sitting there and just watching gracie hold a fork and feed herself as you continue to watch you'll see there's a time that she took her fork and she scooped up her food all by herself that was a very proud moment very thankful to god and so appropriate on thanksgiving she did that so thankful to god that gracie was able to do that this is something we've been practicing and we'll continue to practice until gracie is able to feed herself all alone thank you jesus Guys, Gracie was not liking the sweet potato and the mac and cheese casserole. She loved the mashed potato. <laughs> Gracie, happy Thanksgiving! Yeah! Get better. <laughs> it's not gonna make you win. It's not gonna make you win. Hey, hey, 
<laughs> this is not good though. <laughs> it's not gonna make you win. Here, who won you? Yes, I get first. You're already losing. You're already losing. You cheated. You're already losing. You're already losing. You're already losing. Oh, you know that. How many cards do you have? I have six. Seven. Seven. You're already losing. Okay, mom, you're already losing. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, okay. 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 What is this now? Okay, come on, play. That's what I'm talking about. Your turn, Paul. No mercy. We haven't even got to Wait, your turn. You play, now you play, now me play. Okay, Paul. Take it. That's three cards, play Paul. Okay. Ha! You block you. I'm sorry, Paul. Pick up two. If you don't have that. Do you have one? Do you have one? I lost two. Pick, pick up two. two. Hey, mother. Hey, mother. Your turn, Caleb. Pick up two. Uh uh. You pick up six. <laughs> you, you pick up six. <laughs> you have one? <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm sorry, Caleb. Boy, your turn. I'm sorry, Caleb. Ah, take your time. Ah, 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 ah. I said, don't come back, Caleb. Don't try to do this. Oh, you play. Plus four. Plus four. Play it. Yeah. Plus two. Watching until next time. <laughs> I'm not playing no more. Please. No. No.